So welcome back guys, an exciting review here. We've got the M180 shotgun. I've only tried one of the shotgun before this, so I'm looking forward to putting this to the test just to see if this thing can outperform it. So what's in the box then? We obviously get the shotgun as standard. We get the unjamming rod and we've got a nice black cover here with some secret things inside. Let's find out what we've got. Ooh. So we've got one flashlight. One crosshair sight. We've got a sleeve that fits onto the shotgun so you can store your shells. And we've got four shotgun cartridges. Oh, and we get a little screwdriver if you want to open the attachments up to put extra batteries in. So the M180 then, what features does this thing have? At the top and on the side, we've got some rails for attachments. We've got a standard trigger here with a safety switch above it. And at the bottom of the shotgun, we've got the cartridge loader with this little button just here, which you press in, opens the flap up. You take your cartridge, load it inside, until it clicks, shut the hatch. The cocking handle underneath can be pulled. So we've put all the attachments on. They're pretty easy to fix. You've just got these little screws on the side, which you just undo and tighten to put on. And we've put the clip on the side, which just makes that look and feel a little bit better. So to load your cartridges, you just need to take your speed loader, push it in at the top, and load until full. You can open your chamber up at the bottom, put your cartridge in, shut it up, Cock the shotgun. Woo, that thing's got some power. We have actually got the side as well, a manual hop up, which just goes from left to right. So what we're gonna do now then guys is get on some shooting. We're gonna test the accuracy, the power, and just how cool this thing is. And we'll go for the final verdict. Well guys, that's been the review of the M180 shotgun then. I'm slightly disappointed with this. When I was cocking it, it just wasn't firing every single time. It was like it wasn't drawing a BB into the chamber. Also, when I was actually cocking it, it was actually getting stuck sometimes. It wasn't pulling all the way forward. The power is not too bad, not the best that I've shot. The accuracy is just almost impossible to aim where you're going. The sight gets in the way. It just doesn't seem to shoot where you're going anyway and it took me quite a few attempts to actually get some of the targets down, which was a bit disappointing. So, all in all, it's a cool little shotgun to add to your collection. However, has got some technical faults with the firing, with the accuracy, the power's not the best, but that's been your review. Make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. We'll be back with loads more airsoft guns, nerf guns, and gel gun reviews. See you soon.